You gotta get help. Just go back and look at the few times Lashley's lost. Oh, shows no mercy. Are you kidding me? who is more driven than we've ever seen him. Corey, he just said it was made up. Byron, when's your birthday? August 20th. Cancel Rusev Day. My man. When you talk about power, and his opponent, you talk about this man. The Ravishing Russian Lana from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds. Bobby Lashley! From WWE, but he had unfinished business. He felt like he had more he wanted to accomplish. And so far, Bobby Lashley is on the track to do just that. You can feel the electricity right through this arena. This is going to be something one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match that you'll want to watch over and over again. Rusev is in action on this very festive Rusev Day. Byron, what strategy would you employ against the Bulgarian brute? I go off. I'm pretty big. <laughs> That's so fun. But if I were even bigger, I'd try to overpower Rusev. Guys like John Cena and Roman Reigns were able to match the super athlete's strength and make Rusev take the L. Wait a minute. You just compared yourself to John Cena and Roman Reigns. Have you seen me after a workout pump? Earlier on, Byron mentioned overpowering Rusev, which sounds like a decent strategy. You agree, Corey? Nope. You can't overpower Rusev, especially on Rusev Day. He's beaten the world's largest athlete in the big show, the world's strongest man in Mark Henry. Muscles alone cannot overpower the Lion of Bulgaria. He's in a vulnerable spot now, guys. Look at him. He's wide open for attack. He might have it. Three. Five. Impact. Can he finish the job? Great move by him right there. Yeah, let's see that one again. Look out. Look out. This could be it. Oh my God, get out of the way, get out of the way. This isn't gonna be good. They can't walk after that attack from the back. Let's see that again. Definitely worth a second look. Awesome. He had an impressive amateur career, which led, of course, to his quick ascent in WWE. Well, during his break from WWE, he managed to balance winning MMA championships while also earning titles from top independent promotions. In my opinion, Lash is gonna prove even more dominant this time around. 
Rusev competing here tonight. The super athlete is looking as fast and strong as ever. Defeating Rusev is a tall order. So how can his opponent do it? Corey, I'll start with you. Well, firstly, I wouldn't pick a fight with Rusev on Rusev Day. That's just foolish. Secondly, yeah, this hurts to say, Rusev's been distracted by his own allies, namely Lana and Aiden English. Going back to our discussion on strategy against Rusev, Corey mentioned that Rusev's friends uh, derailed the Bulgarian brute in the past. Do you agree, Byron? Oh, yeah, Michael. Lana proved to be a distraction when Rusev competed against the likes of Rome. But I can't help but get the feeling that this is going to be one of those matches people will be talking about for a long time to come. Oh. Right across. Oh. Heavy duty right hand. start of an ugly downward spiral wow. if he's not careful. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. I know it's somewhat early still, but this could be a pivotal point in this match, guys. Let's see how he reacts here. Well, it sounds like a question with no good answer to it, Corey, but I've got to ask, how do you beat somebody as dominant as Lashley? You got to get help. Just go back and look at the few times Lashley's lost. Almost every single time it took outside interference to get the job done. up a good point. Outside interference has been a common denominator in many of Lashley's losses, dating back to Finley employing the help of Hornswoggle to beat Lashley for the United States Championship. And similarly, Mr. McMahon used help from multiple allies to steal Lashley's ECW title. Fortunately, the Dominator now has a manager who can run counter interference better than anyone in WWE. Roosh oh, on the rear super kick! From behind, nasty. This might be it, guys. This is Rusev's match now. What? Oh. Right across the back of the neck. Got the full Nelson. Full Nelson slam. What's he doing? He's starting to look bleak for him now. I wouldn't be surprised if he just passes out right here. At this point, he has to be thinking to himself, what do I have to do to get back in this thing? Look out, Rusev is measuring. This just ain't gonna do it. Rusev causes mass destruction wherever he goes. The hero of the Russian Federation. The accolades locked in. This one is over. Look at this. The accolades locked in. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? In case you're keeping score, that's twice, Byron. Rusev has the mixed martial arts and wrestling experience to systematically dismantle his opponent. When Rusev's in the ring, prepare to witness a mauling. This man has a disdain for everyone he comes into contact with. Except, of course, for his lovely... Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. 
Well, you know that Bobby Lashley has impressive skills once the bell rings, but he's had to prove himself in some strange new ways as of late. Uh, Michael, you must mean the time Sami Zayn made the Dominator run an obstacle course? Or are you referring to Jinder Mahal's yoga session? It's moves like that that make him so dangerous. Okay, you two joked about, here he goes. Who knows what's gonna happen? This match can go anywhere. Service to his country. Shut up, guys, was a pretty bad move for Zayn. Yeah, it inspired rage and lash that we haven't seen before. The Dominator beat Zayn so bad, it put the former NXT champion on the shelf for nearly a year. This might be it! Oh my! I knew it was only a matter of time. He thinks he has it! Two! And a kick out, much to nobody's surprise. Clearly not enough damage done. He's looking at it. Damn it. But can he follow up here? He may get the three count right there. Two. Digging deep for a kick out. So resourceful. Like Rusev, the accolades locked in. That should do it. That's not even remotely comfortable looking. At some point, the referee may want to think about stopping this one before somebody gets seriously injured. There's the tap. There's the tap. This one's over. Well, this is one matchup that lived up to its billing, and then some. These superstars gave as good as they got, and these fans got their money's worth from the opening bell. That's what I love about the WWE, a match that lives up to expectations, but still finds a way to surprise us. Good stuff. And so it goes. Here is your winner, Rusev. Wow, that tap came quick and often. No shame to tapping out to that move. Wow, that looked incredibly painful. And a big thank you to everybody watching WWE's Hell in a Cell on the WWE Network. What an amazing... Oh, shows no mercy.